Thousands of Detroiters are on their way to Washington, D.C. for the National March Against Police Violence tomorrow. Our Jeff Vaughn caught up with the group. As they boarded the bus, he checks in at number five with more. Hi, Jeff. Hey, Carolyn, good evening. Yeah, this is being called the Justice for All March. And right now, some Detroiters are on their way. They started their journey from the Northland Mall. We're going to tell them about it at the nation's capital. They gather at Northland Mall in Southfield, ready to board two buses that will take them to Washington, D.C. for the Justice for All March on the Capitol Saturday. So once you get on board... This group traveling to D.C. to keep the protests alive for the lack of indictments and recent deaths of unarmed black men. Michael Brown shot in Ferguson, Missouri. Eric Garner dead after a scuffle with police where he told them he couldn't breathe. 11 times. We all need to breathe when we're dealing with police brutality, racial injustice, social injustice. If African Americans cannot breathe, then no Americans can breathe. The National Action Network leading the march with the Detroit chapter organizing the local call for protesters. More than 100 answering as they board the buses for the overnight trip. So we're going to take the prayer and the power of Detroit because we're on the move. I'm told many more are already in D.C. from the Motor City, and even more are making the trip from Detroit to Washington on their own, hoping for change at the national level. And we're looking for Congress to make a move. We're looking for the Department of Justice to make a move. We need to move from investigation to prosecution. A reminder of a possible injustice arriving as the group readies to leave. Security guards with Northland Mall telling the protesters to leave their property. The same security team investigated by police after six mall cops detained Mackenzie Cochran as the 25-year-old Ferndale man dies from asphyxiation. Southfield and the Southfield Police Department to use this parking lot here at Northland Mall to stage and get ready and to leave tonight. However, they were still hassled by security. Now, related to that incident, no indictment or charges on the Northland Mall death of Mackenzie Cochran. It was ruled accidental. However, there is a civil suit pending. As for the Justice for All March, it takes place tomorrow at noon in Washington, D.C. We're live tonight in Southfield. Jeff Vaughn, 7 Action News.